Jason English here with Ripple Effect Consulting. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to everybody out there. Today I wanted to do a quick little short video on what to expect in 2019 and a little bit of a recap of 2018. So 2018 proved to be a really strong year economically. Um, a lot of growth were out in the market, everything from public work projects to uh, information technology, AI, saw a huge growth and um, land development, uh, construction in general. So, um, but kind of what's on the agenda for 2019, what to expect, uh, wanted to kind of go over some of that as well. So in 2018, um, you know, we saw uh, kind of an average labor participation rate of 62.9%. Um, uh, we saw a average hourly income earning, uh, $27.35 was the average hourly income earning. Now these are spread across all different types of industries. Um, last year, this time, in 2017, the unemployment rate was as low as 4.1. Uh, this year, at this time, in 2018, at the end of the year, it's 3.7%. Um, so with that sort of labor participation rate and that sort of unemployment, um, you know, the job market is very, very good for employees. And where I live, Denver, Colorado, uh, it's closer to 1.9% in Denver, and even as low as 1% in some surrounding counties. Just to give you a little bit of insight on how difficult it is to find talent right now, how difficult it is to find talented individuals, um, and also retain and keep talent is proven to be extremely difficult. Um, but that's why a lot of things that we practice and preach, um, you know, about talking to your employees and all that is extremely important. Um, what we are seeing is that in 2019, construction is supposed to continue to increase from what it is this year. Um, transportation in the Denver area is supposed to grow by 2.4%. Um, construction residential is supposed to grow by over 6%. Um, in the civil engineering market, the demand for civil engineers is going to project it to, now these are done from ENR, um, a lot of different sites, is projected to increase by 11%. So 11% more civil engineers are going to be needed in the market. Information technology is very similar to that. Mechanical engineering is um, supposed to be at 8%. Um, and most most of the engineering disciplines uh, are proven to are, are, are showing to be a lot higher um, or a decent amount higher than they are this year so um, you know with all that being said just something to think about going into the new year as you kind of sit and relax and think about contemplate how you're going to handle the demand for employees talent how you're going to retain your talent for 2019 uh, just some something to think about and kind of um, you know just different studies that we've read and went through and what we are seeing in the market in 2019. It should be really exciting. We're excited to dive into it. Um, anybody out there needs help getting talent, finding talent, give me a call. My number's uh, at the bottom here. And uh, I'd love to definitely see if we can help out. Uh, this is Jason English with Ripple Effect Consulting, wishing you a great and safe holiday. Uh, great and safe New Year's and look forward to seeing you in 2019. Cheers.